Like What's up, guys? Welcome to a new video. Uh, this is the Q&A with my girlfriend, Avery. Um, I asked a bunch, or I put a thing on my Instagram story for you guys to ask questions for this video. And uh, my Instagram will be linked down below. But thank you to everybody who asked questions. I really appreciate it, especially the people who asked like multiple questions. It really helps, so we had enough. But uh, let's get into the questions. So the first question is from AIDS Peterson. What would you say is the best lift for bigger mass arms? So just like larger arms. Avery, you want this one? Um, I would say... <laughs> um, you can't really just pick a specific one. It really just like, you can stick to the basics. Like, okay, do normal bicep curls and just try to do more and more weight every time or more and more reps over, every time, progressive overload. overload. And then you could do like tricep cable push downs. Like, there's no real like magic exercise for everything. It just, it depends. It varies. Like, just pick a couple. If you want a couple normal like standing alternating bicep curls, maybe some seated incline curls, uh, cable tricep push downs, skull crushers. There's some for you. So yeah, mm -hmm. it just progressive overload. That's how you get bigger. Okay, this is from V Ella Hand. What is your favorite cheap date night idea? Gosh, well, I mean, Grant's already cheap, so pretty much all of them. <laughs> just kidding. Um, <laughs> I don't know, it's like fun to like just go to Walmart and honestly make a meal with each other because it's cheap, you can like pick the cheapest ingredients and then we can have fun just making it together, so that's probably like one of my favorites, I'd say. Yeah, that's actually what I was going to say. I don't know what you're going to say, but that's what I was going to say. So, mm -hmm. making our own meals, yeah. that's always fun. The next question is from Sebastian Frost. Uh, shout, out, shout out to Sebastian for asking multiple questions. Ella and too. Ella. <laughs> Ella has more coming up and Sebastian has more coming up too. But how much can Avery bench? 500 pounds, like easy. The correct but... <laughs> answer is all of it. <laughs> yes. Actually, I don't actually know. I've never... I don't know. I just got her bench press in like this week. Like yesterday. I benching what? I don't know. It was like... 55, 60 65, pounds. I we're think we're going so. light to get her warm up. She'll probably hit 225 no time. Like next week, I think. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the next question. There's another one from Sibo. Um, make Avery do roids so she's just massive. I don't even need to do roids, Sibo. I already am, but if I did, <laughs> uh, I don't think I want to be massive. So, no thanks. <laughs> okay. I don't think Grant wants to be massive. <laughs> the next one is from Ethan Weinheimer, Avery's brother. Why is Avery submitting to oppressive authority by wearing that face diaper with a emoji, like crying emoji? Um, okay, well, I was only wearing, I wasn't even wearing it for one thing, so you can't actually yell at me. It was on my chin, and also because I didn't really want to get yelled at. Yeah, I don't know. Basically because we have to. It's just kind of a to. habit. We just kind of have to. And yeah, I mean, it's kind of whatever, but yeah. <laughs> College makes us. I mean, yeah. yeah. Um, the next question. Um, this is from Carson Symes. So this isn't actually a question, but Avery Weinheimer sold me drugs. No, I did. <laughs> <laughs> that's a joke, guys. Yeah, for the record, I didn't. for the record, that's a joke. <laughs> Next question is from Gavin underscore Colson 01. Why is Gavin just so amazing? This is my brother, for those of you we who don't know. We still don't know how he is. He's this is actually, this is a trick way. question, actually. This is a trick question, because Gavin is not amazing. That is so not true. You almost had no. me, almost had me there. I, I think Gavin's amazing, but... <laughs> She's joking. <laughs> okay, this is from Sam Clute. I think that's how you say your last name. <laughs> favorite from Mitchell. Well, I only know Sam, so by <laughs> far, you are my favorite. And Same. Yes. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know anybody from Mitchell. I guess I, mean, I know people who go to college. Unless you count people going to college, but still. From Mitchell, you're, you're the only one I know, so by default, you are the favorite. Um, next question comes from Grace Trevs. Also, thank you, Grace, for asking multiple questions. You have like three in a row here. Who is more responsible? Me. I'm just kidding. Me. I don't know, I feel like it's Graham, but... We're both pretty responsible. Yeah, we yeah, definitely yeah. are both. It's not like I'm a lot more responsible, or she's like a lot less. I just I feel like I'm more responsible. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you can go to the next one. Okay, this is also from Grace. Who is funnier? Probably me. <laughs> <laughs> I think we would both say ourselves. I don't know. I make myself laugh a lot. I think we're both funny. Like she's actually funny. <laughs> What is that? <laughs> I don't know. A lot of girls aren't funny, but like she makes me laugh. I make her laugh. Tell she cries a lot. 
it's easy to do that. <laughs> Um, next one, also from Grace, does Avery wear the pants in the relationship? Yes. I make all the, like, I make the decisions. I'm just kidding. I really don't <laughs> even know, It's a weird like, question. I never know. <laughs> I don't know if either of us could say we wear the pants. Like, it's not like I, like, either one of us is like, nope, we're doing this, like, over We're both just chill and we're just like, oh yeah, and we both agree on a lot of things and yeah, stuff, so. Yeah, very chill. Hardly ever. I don't even know. We don't really argue ever. <laughs> Not often. Yeah, this is from Jaden. Um, Jaden Onkin. Yeah, I was like, what's his last name? <laughs> Favorite Call of Duty? Um, Black Ops. <laughs> <laughs> hey, at least you knew a name. Uh, Avery has never played, but I will go with Black Ops 2. That was the one I played the most, had the most fun on. Jacob Howard, if you're watching this, I used to wake up at like 6.30 in the morning before school and play Black Ops 2 on the Xbox 360 with Jacob. Good times, so Black Ops 2 is my favorite. Next question is also from Jaden. Who would win in a fight, Will or Q, as in Quinn? Quinn Georgie. Will's my roommate. Um, you know, I think if either one I pick, they're gonna be really offended that I didn't pick them, like if I don't pick them. It'd be really, a, I think it'd be a tight fight. One, they, they would never fight. Quinn, he's got a mean headlock. Will, I don't know his aggressiveness. I haven't seen that side of him, but, you know, it'd be a really tough fight, but I think I'm going to have to pick Quinn coming out on top. But this is just a hypothetical situation. They would never fight. Will, don't be offended if you're seeing this. But it's, it'd be a really tight one. I just don't know enough about Will's uh, fighting ability to pick him. Okay, this one is from Will. It's Caddy B. Why are you gay? <laughs> Okay, I'll. Uh, this is a common question considering I do have a girlfriend that I'm making this video with, but I'm not actually gay. Contrary to popular belief, like, even though I have a girlfriend, like, I'm not gay. What? <laughs> um, next one's from San Clute. I don't know how to say your last name. I'm sorry if I say it wrong. Um, how do you know the other person was the right one? Still don't know. <laughs> okay. Um,. Okay, I guess, like, I didn't really, like, I don't know the point where, like, okay, when I was deciding to date her, I prayed about it a lot, and it just, like, kept coming in my head, coming in my head, like, all the time, so I just took that as a sign from God that, like, go after it, or go after her, <laughs> and I did, and now we're here, one of the best decisions I've ever made, I don't know, like, when I knew, like, yeah, I guess that'd be, that'd be, like, when I knew she was the one. Just like I kept praying about it, like I started liking her and then I prayed about it and made a decision. Yeah. And I don't know, I'm just following along. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. <Dang. laughs> just kidding. I don't know. Yeah, just. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> it's hard to pick like a specific moment. Yeah. Just like the more time goes on, I guess. I don't know. And especially like we just get along <laughs> really well. We never fight, we're both reasonable people. Like, there's nothing, I like everything about her, so. <laughs> okay, this one is from Colton Lentz. Does Avery do the same workouts as you, or does she do more cardio and high rep based? I do not do the same exact. I was for a little bit, but um, Grant does more like powerlifting, and I don't really want to be a powerlifter. So he did make me a workout plan, so I do that. And then I, I did have another plan that I was doing. <clears throat> I definitely do more cardio probably than Grant. Um, the, like the last workout plan I had, I had to work out like for 30 minutes every day of cardio, plus weights. So that was kind of a lot, and it was more high rep right away. But then I got like more low reps and more weight. But so no, not the exact same, but kind of similar-ish, sort of. <laughs> yeah. So like sometimes she'd work out with me and do what I was doing, um, but her last plan was a lot of high rep, like 15, 20 reps for a lot of stuff. But now the one I made her, it's more so like, it's more lower, like in the hypertrophy range. So yeah, and she does more cardio. I don't really do a lot of cardio. I don't. I just don't really want to. Um, this question's from Sebastian Frost. Plans for this winter bulk or cut? Um, so I'm currently in a bulk. I started my bulk. I don't even know. I made a YouTube video like something like I'm becoming a power lifter. So like. That's when I started doing powerlifting, when I started my bulk. And honestly, well, I have 
two or three more weeks left of it until my plan's done for powerlifting, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna start my cut. But I'm trying to I'm gonna try to be really slow and like specific with it, and like can, like so I'm not losing much muscle, just not drastic, just a little bit every week, a little bit of a deficit every week. Um, Cause honestly, I don't. I'm excited for that. I feel fat. Like this morning, especially when I was looking in the mirror, I've definitely gained weight, but not like a ton. I've gotten a lot stronger, but I just feel like hefty. Like I did not like how I looked this morning, especially like specifically this morning. So I'm excited to get into the cut and drop down, be more lean. But so I'm in a bulk going into a cut. So another one from Sebastian. Favorite exercise? Uh, I don't know what my favorite would be. Probably like. I don't know, I like doing abs. I'm good at ab workouts, I guess. Ma, it's tough to pick a favorite. My favorite like exercise overall, I don't know, I always think like my big three lifts, so squat, bench, deadlift. It's probably bench right now, because that's like gone up the most weight wise, and I, it just like feels good. Yeah, bench press right now. Okay, another question from Sebastian. Plans on opening up coaching spots, so, very, very soon, I'm going to have a website up where I'm going to sell workout programs and personalized coaching from me. So, like, I plan on having that up, like, a couple weeks max. I should have that done and up. So, be stay tuned for that. And if you, like, if you don't want to wait that long, like, you really just want to, like, get a plan or get coached by me, like, stat, you can DM me on Instagram and we can figure something out. But until then, I'm going to have a website with everything coming up in the manner of a couple weeks. I'm really excited for it to start selling programs and personalized like plans and everything coaching. So very, very soon. Uh, another one from Sibo. Can you train hypertrophy slash strength at the same time? I do not. Okay, so <laughs> um, well they're kind of like two different rep ranges of sorts. So like hypertrophy is normally like 8 to 10, 10 to 12 I believe, and then strength is the lower reps. So. Uh, you, you can at the same time. I mean, that's kind of what I'm doing. Like, my big three lifts are in the strength range, and then my other stuff's in the hypertrophy range. And by training hypertrophy, you can increase your strength. And by increasing your strength, you can increase, like, your just, like, looks, like your muscle size and everything. Like, they can go hand in hand together, and I work them out together. So, yes, yeah, so you can do them both at the same time, but I don't know. I'm not, like, I don't know a whole ton about, like, the two different things that much. I don't know. Uh, next question from Sebastian. Do you use creatine? Yes, I do. Uh, what I do is I'll use, like, I'll get a tub of creatine. I'll take a scoop every day with my protein, with my protein shake. And then once I run out of that tub, I'll wait a week or two before I get a new tub. And then I'll start the cycle again. Uh, and I made a video about the supplements I use. I'll link that in the description down below or it'll pop up here if you guys want to go watch, you know, what I use and what I recommend. Oh, another one from SIBO. Best supplements for beginners? Uh, whey protein, creatine. Those two, basically, they're the basics. Especially whey protein, just to make sure you get your protein intake in. Uh, again, watch that video up here, just up there, because I address all that and what I recommend. Um, question from Gracie May Weinheimer. What is your favorite food that Avery cooks? Oh gosh, it is really tough to pick. <laughs> Avery does a lot of baking. Ah, oh, my favorite food that you cook. <laughs> I don't even know if I can ha have a favorite. I don't know if I can have a favorite. Like, she's cooked a lot of times and I've been there, but it's not like she's cooked enough for me where I'm like, yep, this one stands out. Like, I don't think I've had anything that you've made twice. Probably not really. So I don't think I can say a favorite. It'd be, it'd be really tough. Yeah, like nothing comes to mind like specific favorite, like it's all just really good. Um, this is from Ella again. Future plans, individual, or she said goals technically, and then individual and as a couple. Um, I guess individual goals are to like start kind of like getting more into baking because I am really into that. So like, I don't know, maybe make like my own Instagram, whatever, for baking and stuff, and just like start making videos stuff. Grant is very encouraging in that. And then just kind of, yeah, having that get going, I guess, probably. It's probably one of my biggest goals right now. So you guys stay tuned for when she does that. <laughs> I'll be posting all about it so you guys can follow her and everything, but that should be cool and fun. Uh, my individual plans, keep doing this stuff, my keep growing 
uh, start selling coaching and workout programs very soon and maybe some merch on the website eventually not sure when I'll get that done but uh, just do that keep going keep going with my schoolwork and yeah basically keep doing everything I'm doing and then a uh, couple of goals do we have a couple of goals? I don't know. <laughs> Keep growing together. Yes. <laughs> and in our faith and stuff. Yeah, probably. Keep on keeping on. Mm -hmm. Be happy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, next question from Ella. Favorite movie? This is tough. I, I can't pick a specific one, but when somebody asks me this, I always say the Star Wars movies or the Lord of the Rings movies. Yes, I'm a nerd. <laughs> I don't know. I honestly do not know. There's so many movies. Maybe The Help. I don't know why that stood out to me. Maybe that's it. <laughs> oh, this is also from Ella. Avery's favorite zoo animal. Probably like a giraffe. I don't know. I just think they're cool. Cool print. Very tall. Very interesting looking. Yeah. <laughs> that's a good one. Um, another one from Ella. <laughs> if Avery was a worm, would you still date her? Avery has actually asked me this question. She saw it on TikTok. But yes, <laughs> guys always answer yes. Um, even though I wouldn't really be able to tell like which end was your butt, which end was your face, that might be tough, but yes. Uh, another one from Ella. Top three fears. Uh, probably spiders, snakes, and... Fear of like falling, <laughs> not just like um, heights, but like falling. Obviously, yeah. What about you? Snakes. Um, drowning. And get serious here. Um, dying unhappy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um. Next question. Keenan, this is from Keenan Johnson. We're not related, guys, just so you know. Uh, but we do know each other. We're friends. This one is for Aves. Who is the coolest Johnson you know? Dwayne Johnson. <laughs> We're pretty tight, actually. <laughs> I knew. I was thinking about this, like, who is Avery going to say that's just, like, a dumb thing to say? And I didn't know who she'd say right away, but you had it on the spot. Good job. Um, this one's from Trey Ortman. Shout out to Trey, you asked a question in my uh, video with Colton after our like fitness challenge, and I appreciate that. Thank you for asking questions and being active. Uh, but I started lifting the summer going into my freshman year of high school. So like right before I was getting to high school sports, I started lifting that summer. And I've just gotten more and more serious as time went on. How about you, Avery? <sighs> Literally probably this year, <laughs> because I didn't really lift before that. I guess I did for like track some, but definitely was not serious ah just kidding I did for a little bit junior year I don't know it's kind of been in spurts but like seriously definitely this year okay from Colton who's the best feature you've had on YouTube your YouTube videos obviously me I mean I, I can answer this for him but <laughs> <laughs> I don't know statistically speaking the videos with Pete like featuring other people that have done the best have both included you the Colton Lentz our calorie challenge video <laughs> and then uh, like our eating video and then also our like recap from our fitness challenge those videos were some of the best ones I've had and you were in them so it statistically speaking I think it's you maybe I don't know I'd have to look <laughs> but tough choice tough choice had a lot of great people in my videos and this one's from Gabrielle McQuirk I just like butchered saying that <laughs> English is hard um who's your favorite cook Avery my grandma Dorothy or my grandma Ida Mae I am impressed that you know my grandma's name. Okay, I figured she did. Um, okay, I thought about this. They are really good in their own ways, so I cannot pick a favorite. Well, Avery, really good at baking. My grandma Dorothy, she has like her staple stuff that she makes all the time, like some German dishes. Grandma Ida Mae, she has some staple stuff that she makes really good all the time, like more with like wild game. Swedish pancakes, rhubarb pie. Avery, she's really good with all the baking. And I still, like, I need to get more, you gotta make more food, I guess, so I can, like, <laughs> pick favorites no. and stuff. But yes, all three of them are great. <laughs> um, 
this one. Um, at a this is from Quinn Georgie. At Avery, how does it feel to be dating a beefcake like Grant? <laughs> um. <laughs> Good, I guess. I don't know. That's very <laughs> weird. <laughs> Beefcake. Okay, our last question. This is pretty serious. From Morris guys. Hofer. How many? Too many. All of them. <laughs> okay, <laughs> but that's everything, guys. Thank you for watching. They kind of, I guess it's 20 minutes ish, but thanks for watching. I like this. This was fun. Mm, this one. We'll, we'll definitely do this again multiple times, probably, because I plan on doing this for a long time. But thank you, especially to everybody who asked questions. You guys are real ones. I really appreciate it. And uh, if you have any more questions, like that didn't get answered or something, uh, I left a couple out because they're inappropriate. I could answer those off the record, maybe. <laughs> but um, more questions, drop them down below in the comments or DM me or Avery on Instagram. But thank you for watching. Yes. It was fun. Uh, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, comment something nice, and... Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. To myself, this. We have another question. For Ella, how does it feel to be the third wheel? <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer. <laughs>